I'm here at the Amazon Shelby Township Fulfillment Center where female industry leaders are passing the torch of knowledge to a group of high school students on the path to STEM careers. Anybody who's looking to go into engineering, especially to the younger females, I would tell them to power through with it. Um, find something, find a study buddy to keep working with them through it. Um, it can get tough, it can get grueling. Engineering's not easy for a reason, but just having a community with you to keep working through it and know that you're going to be able to change the world someday. Amazon's top performing facility in the country can count its success on the role women play in the day-to-day -day operations. And now those women are dropping jewels to a group of girls from Regina High School to inspire them to study the world of science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. I love pulling the potential from people to help them become the best that they can be. That gives me the motivation to keep going forward. I love being able to just engage people and drive them. Driving people to be a team makes us want to work better and hit what we want to hit. And at the end of the day, that's fulfilling the customer's order. Tuesday, female leaders hosted a tour for inquiring minds, giving them a behind the scenes glimpse of what a day at work looks like. With more than 1,000 employees, it takes a lot of manpower to get deliveries out, but site leaders say the power of women keeps the operation functioning. The processes and the way that my brain works, I love numbers, I like science, I like when you tell me that this is a theory, I can apply it and I, it works. There's no if ands, or buts behind it. Kennedy Roscoff is a junior at Regina High School. She says the experience inspires her to explore STEM education in her future endeavors. I've always liked math. I've always had an interest in it. I think just seeing like all the women and how they have like a big part in it, like it's not like, yes, STEM is a male dominated field, but they're not looked at as like less than. I totally think I could see myself working here just like one of them. I don't think like just because I'm a woman, I won't be able to get it. Reporting in Shelby Township, Chris Walker, CBS News, Detroit.